have my dog, so I don't feel uncomfortable um, saying that they have to stop barking. Everyone DMs me and says, we love when your dogs come on. So hold on a minute. Scarlett's um, not saying. Okay, you, um, everyone loves your dog. Speaking of Margaret, because you just brought up Margaret, now you yeah. just made me realize something. Um, you know what we have to talk about? What? You know, everyone listens to us. This is said with no ego. Everyone listens. No. This is, okay, listen. A, many, a long time ago, hey. after like, not even last season of Beverly Hills, one of the Beverly Hills seasons, I said something and I don't know what I was saying. And I was talking about how like Lisa Vanderpump was probably going to come back. And like, she needs like something that starts with a two. She would never come back for 1 million. Lila de Paola, behave yourself. Um, They're going to start howling. Oh gosh. gosh. Well, this is an important point here. Oh, um, I'm sorry. So I was on with Catherine Edwards, our, our Beverly Hills resident expert. And I was saying like, you know, Lisa might come back. I don't even know what season this was. And she would have to have something that starts with a two. And this, this was me and Catherine. The next thing I know, the sun, the, the sun, the paper, the sun says insider, an exclusive insider report says Lisa Vanderpump is in the mix for something that starts with a two. It was, and I read this and I said, Oh my God. I think they I'm took- the inside, which at least <laughs> say, Dave, why can't you just say David Yontef on behind the day? I agree. No, I, I, agree. I wasn't, this wasn't, I was, and I read this and I said, this is my fucking pop. I, I, I'm the insider. Now yep. I mind in my own business. These listeners a week later, David, this is you. This is what I said. Fuck you. I knew it. I knew that that was. Yep. Awesome. Yep. This, so then that was three years ago. Now, yeah. You and I recently said, and I was just talking out of my asshole. That's hysterical. And I said, you know, what did I say? I said, I wonder about if, Margaret yeah, going I to said, the producers. When this rumor came out that she went to producers. Oh my God. Now she hung up. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Lila Di Paola has hung up the phone. Oh, Kim, she's coming back. I mean, I really should edit this out, but you guys seem to like all these little parts that are in between. You say it makes sense. <laughs> I mean, Kim, come on now. I'm like talking. They started the fighting. They fight this over is me. too much. This is too much. Listen, Kim, come on back on. Nobody can see you. I okay. can't even believe it. Listen to me. <gasps> I okay. can't believe that just happened. Okay, don't worry about it. We're not going to edit it out. The, 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 no, keep it in. Keep the, it in. That the, happens. The train has been moving. Listen, now you and I talked, and we, when Margaret went with the rumors, she went to producers yes. and said, I don't want to film with Louie. You and I said, what an idiot. What a moron. How dumb. You're going to lose your job. Then a week later, <laughs> we said, you know what? We said, Margaret's not dumb. We said, no. I bet you she's going to this for as an HR play and legal and lawyers, and she's probably trying to save her job. Now, it has come out. And this once again, the son that an insider has said that Margaret Joseph is lawyering (laughs) up. And I am telling you, people started sending me this. They said, David, you're the insider. Yep. And then now she calls Tamara and Tamara says, I spoke to Margaret and this is so untrue. I think it might be untrue. I think you and I might be the ones that started the rumor. rumor. Well, and it really wasn't inadvertently. Just, there's no rumor. We're just giving our opinion. Why is why are these this major shit. national publications? I love it. What we say. I mean, sorry, Margaret. I think that ain't right. on me. That ain't on me. No, nope. she's telling Tamara. So I don't know. Is this true? Do you think we? I think we're the ones that put this out there. I right? think we are. I think we are. I think we're the ones. Wow. Yep. I think we are. So listen. you know what? It is what it is. It's all good. Margaret's not not filming with anyone. Margaret's taking nah. her check. She said she's, she's very professional and she will film. She would never say that because she's too professional a person. Very professional. She got sued for how much money? Because she put a, fu- Thank a you. whale. A whale. Is this Thank woman? You. Is this woman a fucking moron? I'm going to start talks a company. She out of both sides of her mouth. I'm going to start a company and I'm going to, you know what my company is? You see this little penguin here at the penguin, you know, well, I'm going to do this and I'm going to put a penguin. And when I'm done, I'm going to put a horse. I'm going to put a guy yeah, a horse, with like, like a yeah. polo stick riding a horse on, on a polo shirt. And I'm going to go sell it. This is, yeah. this is my brilliant idea. And you know what? I'm going to call it polos. P O L. There you go. There you go. And I'm going to make a million dollars. This woman, million. a penguin, a penguin. Is she in, I mean, a fucking whale. Is she you a can't. moron? Can't write um, the shit. By the way, I didn't even tell you about how I ended up having dinner with Bo Deedle. Oh my God. What and talk- Sid. And Sid. And Sid. Talk about a comedy of it's like, I'm gonna spare you some of the the, the moving parts here. Okay. 
it's a long story. So Rachel was in town with her podcast producer who knows Sid. Okay. What are the chances? What are the chances? So remember, and I was in New York and then Rachel and I were getting, going to dinner with the podcast producer, the p- woman, the podcast producer is like my friend Sid. Do you, what? Sid? Excuse me? <laughs> How do you know Sid? I can't stand it. So Sid is like, listen, we're going to go to dinner. The next thing you know, the phone is ringing. Sid and Bo are close. Sid's on. The- right, what right. What are the chances? Uh, <gasps> Sid. Um, by the way, when Sid met me. What restaurant were you at? Hold on. When Sid met me, he was like, hi. Then, well, that's just whatever. Let's just fast forward to what restaurant? So the phone rings and it's Bo Deedle. Sid. I can't see Tonight, we have an opening. There's not everyone at Rails. There's this, well, I'm with, you know, blah, blah, blah. David Yontef. David Yontef. <gasps> My new friend. Dave. Stop it. You can't make this shit up. You can't. You the can't. The next thing you know, driving down in his BMW. I he, can't. With, with, with. To with, Harlem. I'm, I'm Harlem. like, I'm like the police. I can park anywhere. Just pull oh, right yeah, up. I used to park right in the front, McGregor. Oh yeah. Right in the front. In the middle of Harlem. Absolutely. In, in the car with yeah. Bo Deedle driving up to Harlem. Get out. We're at Reyes. Reyes. I can't stand it. I can't stand it. We walk in. Bo's like, you're sitting there. You're, I mean, like <gasps> Rachel and I sit down. We have like literally our backs are like, we have like the worst seat that we would have chosen. Rachel's like, I would have chosen. I'm like, I mean, not the, not the table, but you know how like if yeah, you yeah, sit yeah. in a corner, when your like, seats sit, yeah. yeah. So Bo's like, you're sitting there, you're sitting there. So we said, Rachel's like, I would have chosen this, those empty seats on the other side. I was like, me too. I was like, oh my do, God. Do, you, do you want to tell Bo that you prefer to sit over there? She's like, no. I'm like, do you? I'm like, no. So oh my God. we're like, just sit here. So then Bo's like, you guys sit here. But Sid and I are going to go outside for some business. They, go, I don't know where they go. Sid comes back in, David Yontef. I, I'm like, so I think Bo said as they were yes, asked, like yes. this is, and Sid then realized before Sid was like, yeah, whatever. Hi, like, yeah, hi. Couldn't I even, love couldn't it. even, he's like, who's, who's this gay guy? Like, I don't need to spend time. Talking. I can't stand it. I can't. Couldn't even can't. give me, he comes the back. time after, of day. He comes back and David Yontef, I didn't know that was you. Do, 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 do. <laughs> <laughs> talks about like uh, there's stuff I'll tell you off. You can't write this shit. Nope. Wow. He's like, Good he's for like, David. What a night. What he, a he night. Said, Sid, Sid said, and they, I didn't say it. Sid said, listen, your podcast has blown up. I, I didn't bring it up. He's like, I'm going to have you on my morning show, blah, blah, blah. Sure. Yeah. That would be great. Bo. I mean, listen, would I have ordered? Bo different- loves you. He loves, loves. you. He had, I'm he was, so happy. He, he was, I'm packing, so happy. He, he, he was packing heat. He had the gun. Of course he is. Of course he is. I Listen, love I love Bo. I said this. He was always respectful of me. I used to be at Rayo's once a month. Rayo's is fabulous. It's just wonderful. I'm glad that you got to experience it. Did Bo like Rachel? 